Hi everyone, this is Ms. Crow and I'm going to go ahead and show you today what our remote class is going to be looking like. Yes, we had to figure out some kinks and I'm very happy to do that. So now we're going to go ahead and get started with how things look. Okay, so tomorrow morning, first thing, it's a Tuesday. It's our first day back after spring break. You're going to go to courses and your child is going to click the course of that correlates to their grade. Now, all of our third graders have this class. All of our fourth graders have this class. So there should be no problem finding this and being able to keep it. We were able to get rid of the glitch that was stopping us from before. So first things first, I want you to see the remote schedule. All of these are clickable links. However, it can also be found in another place. So on Tuesday, as we go ahead and see, we can also see that there is math. We have our reading folder and then we have our science and social studies. So easy way to find me is to just go ahead. We're just gonna walk through every single assignment throughout the day. Um, so that way this can be a little bit more self-managed by our students. So first we're going to start with Call Miss Crow. If you need to, you can find me right there. Watch CNN 10 is going to be right there. Um, discussion about CNN 10 right here. Then we have our math, Zern, and math center. So you're going to go ahead and do all of this with me until about 9.30 or 9.40. Then we will have reading. That is when the students, so then the students will finish up their Zern and their math centers on their own. They are going to call me back at 1040. So there is the link to click if you're having a hard time seeing um, the above schedule. Then we have our two reading assignments. They will probably finish the Edmentum without being on the computer with me. So that'll be something that they do independently. But again, it's just walking straight through the list. Finally, you have science and social studies. And there is the link that goes along with that. That it does not have a link to call me. So it is a time when they are working on that asynchronously. Okay, so I'm hoping that this will kind of solve some of our issues. I'm very excited uh, to see where we go next. Uh, thank you, remote students and parents for your patience as I figured this out. Um, once again, if you have any questions, you can always just let me know because I can adjust things as needed when I hear from you guys. So thank you so much for your support. I look forward to seeing your student tomorrow. Goodbye.